Good enough this, thanks again for tuning in to yet another video of Infamous coming at you from the West Coast, yet again, San Jose, California. Um, here I am once again, we are fixing the Plex audio system once again. This is now my second set of speakers from Rockford Bosgate. Man, these things are made in China, I just don't know. Uh, Harley Davidson just partnered up with them uh, for their 2022 models for their Stage 2 uh, Boom Audio. And they're offering Rockford Fosgate components. So here I am trying it out again. I know these are made in China. I don't know if there's a quality control issue or something along those lines. My first set didn't last me a year. And then shortly after replacing them, uh, I'd say somewhere around maybe three months, four months, I started having audio issues. And I don't know, I mean, I played it safe. I kept it under the, the red indicator when, you know, sound levels are getting dangerously high on the on the uh, Samsung you have this little indicator your Bluetooth signal symbol turns red and now you're getting kind of loud so anyways I've been writing this thing in the mornings and it just has this little odd crackling noise to it it just it sounds a little distorted um, the first time there was something notable uh, I think the I think the uh, the tweeter inside of the left speaker went out so it sounded muffled now it just sounds distorted so I'm gonna try swapping out the speakers once again and like a <laughs> battered um, girlfriend that keeps on going back um, you know not to make fun of or light heart of, of that situation I mean if you're having issues you guys got to seek help uh, it's not worth <laughs> being in those relationships anyways uh, we're gonna try them again this is of course the T152 these have now gone up in price these are now $170 compared to last year two years ago I bought them in November 2020 the second time uh, 2020 November 2020 that's when I bought my second set and um, that was $130 so they've gone up by 30 bucks so hopefully we see those extra $30 in the overall quality of this product that's what I'm hoping for um, I you know only time will tell so let's go ahead and break this seal as you guys can see this is a, a brand new seal maybe I should use the overhead cam and that's uh, it says here quality Rockford quality let's see if that's just, let's see if that's true in case you guys were wondering overall dimensions uh, this was brought up last time for the Plex audio as you can see we have a five and a quarter size speaker this is the 5.25 and from here to here it's actually six inches i don't know did they send me the right one and then on the bottom of it on the bottom or maybe i could just zoom in on the bottom of the speaker as you can see it's 4.8 inches and depth of the overall speaker it's 2.3 or two inches so if you're out there and looking for replacements and you're getting tired of rockford fosgate's uh, bad quality then you can look for those dimensions and that should fit your Plex audio of course you don't have a lot of room in here it's an all-in-one unit from Plex audio the system has been great the Bluetooth uh, everything the app everything has been amazing uh, the mounting system this is a universal bracket that has been great everything's been great except for the damn uh, speakers <laughs> themselves so let's go ahead and open this box enough rambling I can't find my tools of course like always so I'm using this crazy 12 inch with the uh, with the hex key, with the Torx key just to kind of speed stuff up I'm not sure I'll probably use the the actual component that I have to or the actual tool so let's go ahead and open this up you guys can see that it's absolutely brand new and let's just open it up you guys already seen my other video you guys already know what's in this uh, this is the, the second time now these are little inserts for six by nines if that's what you need them for we're not going to use those and here are the speakers just like before you know what they look exactly the same guys uh, nothing much has changed new speaker grills and that's you know what they look like so this is exactly the same speaker from uh, before and this smells smells brand new I mean this smells brand new just hoping they last 
at least two years i'm hoping because i mean if you're replacing your speakers every <laughs> six months then what's the point you might as well just throw those uh in helmet speakers and just you know just save your <laughs> save your money 170 dollars every single time your speakers go out and i've seen others other posts rockford fosgates customer service hasn't been the best they haven't been great i don't know maybe from them partnering partnering up with harley davidson with them partnering up with harley davidson i just can't say the word right now i mean it's late in the night i'm just trying to get these fixed because i, I want to have my my audio back uh with them hooking up with harley davidson getting into a partnership with them uh, I don't know. Hopefully we see something a little bit better. Of course, when you go stage two, you're looking at what? $800, $900. Uh, if you guys saw the ST, the Lowrider ST speaker system, that's $1,000. So for a thousand bucks, they got to work. I mean, for reals. And I believe they're using this setup. If you guys seen the post or you guys see my other videos, they're using 5.25, five and a quarter speakers. So somehow they're fitting this bad boy with an amp bluetooth and they're making everything work so you guys saw the speakers brand new of course now let's get into the plex audio and i'm gonna swap them both out all right so here we have the old speaker um you know i man i, I don't get this thing wet i take care of them like i said i don't push them too loud and they still went out. I just don't understand what's going on with this thing. But uh, here's the measuring tape. You guys are wondering from the uh, from the actual bolting area down to the bottom of the speaker. You are a little bit past two inches. So I guess an inch and one eighth. In case you're wondering what's going to fit. And of course the actual, you know, I guess the bolting. It is, you know what, it's actually five and a quarter. So it is five and a quarter from from this uh point of of where the bolt goes in or the screw to this point it is exactly at five and a quarter on the dot so there you have it five and a quarter by two inches anything in those dimensions are going to fit your plex audio system so there they are these are the brand new speakers they're not installed of course i'm going to throw them in i'm going to throw them on the bike and see how they sound i'm going to use the old uh, grills because they're already all dinged up of course and they're worn down a little bit from my risers there's not a lot of room for these in the back of my lowrider s so i'm going to reuse these and in case you're wondering if you wanted to customize this of course this is the time to do it uh you would have to you know just paint these you use some masking tape right over the little logo cover that up and you can paint these different colors if you guys follow them on, on social media or on instagram you can see that people have been customizing these you could also remove your speakers and then paint the actual housing of the plex audio so that's you know that's pretty much it in case you were wondering um you know you have the uh you have the dark smoke wire that's your negative and then you have the clear uh, wire and that's your positive if they're still using of course that speaker wire who knows but there's a little indicator at the back and i'll just show you guys right here right on top right there you have negative and positive right there so in case you were wondering that's what that is all right so you guys just stay out there stay safe don't believe everything you read lice the risk get out there and ride later <laughs>